Now, your latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Kevin Holmes. Here are your headlines for Sunday, October 25th. Investigators say Donald Ray Jackson Jr. suspected in the deaths of two sons in Leavenworth, Kansas. Jackson accused of abducting his two daughters during this getaway. Eventually, troopers and deputies arrested him in Beckham County, Oklahoma, near the Texas border. The Sheriff's Department in a Facebook post said two tips, one from a vigilant truck driver, led to the arrest. Carly Jackson being held in Oklahoma on a complaint of child abduction. He still faces an extradition hearing there before he would return to Kansas. Leavenworth County prosecutor telling 41 Action News they have not yet filed charges because the case is still under investigation. The Kansas City Health Department shut down several bars in the past few days over mask and capacity violations. The Juke House got its health permit suspended due to critical food safety violations in addition to mask and capacity violations. Bob's in Motion on Troost closed Thursday night and O'Dowd's on the Country Club Plaza closed Saturday night. To reopen, each bar has to submit a comp compliance plan, which the health department has to approve. The Chiefs just dominated the Denver Broncos this afternoon in Denver, defeating them 43 to 16. Mahomes finished 15 of 23 for 200 yards. Running, black, running back Clyde Edwards Elaire totaled 63 yards from scrimmage and a touchdown. And the new acquisition, Le'Veon Bell. He rang their bell for 39 yards on six carries in his debut. Gary Lee Zach with your forecast. Winter weather advisory. Snowfall mounts from a dusting to three inches. The heaviest might be just south of Kansas City. We'll just have to see, but a dusting to an inch is what I'm expecting here in the city. All right, as we also see a tropical system down to our south. Wow, what does that mean for later this week? More on that in the next few days. 4 to 6 a.m., the roads still more likely dry. 8 a.m. to 4 p.m., snow increases with the heaviest of the south. We'll keep you updated. I'm meteorologist Gary Lezak.